Hello friends, welcome to my channel Devs Coding Hub. Today we are going to enjoy the fourth video of MS Excel 2010 series. So let's start. The first topic we are going to cover is editing of cells or editing cells. The term editing cells means or editing cell means to make changes in the data contained in a cell. Suppose you have typed some data in a particular cell and if I want to change the data I'll edit that cell. So let us see how to edit the contents of a cell. Editing cell by overwriting its data. What you can do? You can directly overwrite the data stored in a cell while editing it. Number two, editing cell by partial modification. That means we are not deleting or removing the entire contents of the cell but we are modifying some part of it. The next two options you can perform in editing are undo and redo. Undo goes back to the previous state by eliminating or cancelling the most recent change. It always goes one step back at a time and redo is used to revert the action performed by undo then we have two more options cut paste and copy paste cut paste is used to move the contents of a cell to another cell or move some part of the cell content to another cell whereas copy paste is used to copy the contents of one or more cells to another location so let us see all these operations in Microsoft Excel. This is the Excel screen. Suppose in the D5 cell India is written. Now I want to change this India to Bharat. So what I need to do, I need to select this cell. If a cell is selected, I can directly type to overwrite its contents. Its contents. So let me type Bharat B H A R A T and hit enter. Now this is changing the content of a cell by overwriting. So this type of editing changes the entire content of the cell. Let us now see how you can edit the content of a cell by using partial modification. Suppose we write in G cell G5 cell David So Instead of David, I want to make it VID. So what can I do for partial modification? I can double click on the cell G5. I can move my cursor 
by using arrow key or by using mouse I can click after A and press backspace to remove D and A now the content of the cell is VID and if I press enter it will be made permanent so this is how we will be doing partial modification one more way we can do partial ed editing is to select the cell and press F2 if we press F2 then we are in edit mode then if I want to change this VID to video then I can add E and O at the end of the VID now if I press enter or click on this tick sign it will be made permanent one more way we can edit the content of a cell is by selecting the cell and going to the formula bar if I click on the formula bar I can make this video as videos suppose we are making this video as videos so after that I can click on this tick sign or I can hit enter to complete the operation this is how we can do partial modification with the content of a cell next thing we are going to learn is the use of undo and redo so let us see the undo operation is used to go back to the previous state or go back to the previous command that was in effect so previously this videos was written as video so if I do undo this will become video now if I do a undo operation I can again get back the previous data that is undone this operation is called redo now if I click on this redo button on the quick access toolbar again this video will be converted into videos now if I perform undo then only I can do redo you can see that the redo option is disabled now as because there is no undo operation done this is last operation you have performed and after that no more operation is there so if I go back by undoing two times I can do redo two times this is how we will be editing using undo and redo the next option is using cut and paste operation so let us see how we can perform cut and paste operation cut and paste operation are performed in a sequence a cut is always followed by paste so if I want to move this D5 cells data which is Bharat to A1 cell what I can do I can select the cell right click on the cell select cut from the shortcut menu and then I can again right click on the A1 cell and choose paste operation so now the data is moved from d5 cell to a1 cell this is how we can do cut and paste one after another to move the contents of a cell to another cell similarly 
you can make a duplicate copy of your cell's data by selecting the cell right clicking on it and selecting the copy option followed by a paste operation suppose I want to paste it in I1 cell so right click on the I1 cell and choose paste now we get another copy of the word Bharat in I1 cell this is how we can do cut paste that is move and copy paste that is duplicating if you have liked my video then please do like and share and don't forget to subscribe if you are new and please press the notification bell to get reminders on my uploaded videos thank you